Hey guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be reacting to Dior Spring Summer 2021 collection. It's going to be outfits, handbags, accessories, all that. And before we begin today's video, please subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram at Trish Trin. Use my hashtag CDRholics to share your posts with me, your latest purchases, anything at all. Just use my hashtag. And also, I'm doing this thing where if you suggest a video down below and I choose a video, I'll give you a shout out. So just comment down a video suggestion and then your social media or even your business, anything that you want me to give a shout out to, just comment down below. And I do have a TikTok. It's at Trish Trin. Trin has two H in the end. And I am probably going to try to film a video for TikTok this weekend. I have no idea what to film, but I will try to film something. And yeah, let's just get started with today's video. So I'm just going to move over, that way I can post the photo that I'm going to be talking about. So today was actually the Dior Spring Summer uh, Runway Show, and it was online so everyone could look at it. And right now I'm on a Dior website looking at all of the outfits, and I'm going to post the first photo right now. So the first one, um, so before I actually talk about the outfits, in this collection, I kind of feel like um, a lot of the colors would be like green, blue, and white, and black. Those are the main colors that pop out to me. So this first outfit, uh, it looks like we have kind of like a kimono um, cardigan jacket. It's long. It's actually pretty quite cute. It looks like it's oversized. The arm, the sleeves look like it's really like wide. So it's kind of like flowy. It kind of like Coachella kind of vibes and then the inside we have a bra and then shorts which are kind of like Dior underwear if you guys seen like Dior underwear and bra their lingerie collection it kind of similar to that um, the book tote it's something new um, I can't tell if it's a book tote or like a like a small like cylinder bucket bag because it's, it doesn't show the side so I can't really tell what it is it has some of those like small fringes on the bottom of the handbag. Fashion jewelry are very nice. It's kind of like tribal like. Um, it looks like she's wearing a headband. It could be a mitzvah scarf and she tied it as a headband. And then her sandals are black. I can't really tell what it is, but the first look is really good. Uh, the second one, I probably may skip a few outfits just talking about like the main ones that I want to focus on. Um, the second one, it kind of looks like she's wearing a dress. It could be a top and then she's wearing a skirt under, not too sure. She's wearing a, like a black, what do you call it? It wouldn't really be like a vest, it's kind of like a jacket. It looks like you could probably zip it up, I'm not too sure, it's kind of hard to tell. And of course she has her long uh, necklace, always those like long drop earrings and then the long fashion jewelry necklaces. And then... Third one is a very nice shade. It's good for fall, but this is in the spring summer. This one's kind of like a camel tan color. Very nice dress. Uh, don't have that much uh, to say on that one. The fourth outfit, um, I wouldn't really say ready to wear is my favorite in this collection. It's kind of hard to tell right now because um, later on there might be like different ones because usually when there's a collection there are two waves. Um, this fourth outfit is really nice dress. The handbag, which is a medium Lady Dior, and this one, um, there is a strap attached. It looks like it's a new strap. It kind of looks like a yellow mustard uh, guitar strap. Um, I think it actually goes really well with the outfit because it's brown and the strap is yellow and her outfit's yellowy brown, so it matches really well. And then the next outfit is the fifth one. Um, this one, I can't really tell what the print is. But I do like the belt that she is wearing. It's kind of similar to, um, uh, I can't remember which collection it was, but it's kind of similar to like the, it's kind of like a rope, a rope belt. Really nice. I don't own one, but I am considering it. It is really nice and it's like a new touch instead of like the leather or lambskin kind of belts. Uh, this one is like kind of like a rope material. Uh, let's see. The fourth, uh, actually the next outfit, you guys, I'm kind of losing track of what number I'm on. Uh, the sixth outfit, uh, it's really nice. She's also wearing like a lingerie, it's like a bra and uh, underwear, but it's 
You can also, some people, they use lingerie as swimming suit. I don't think they swim in it, but they do take a picture of it next to the pool. So there's that. And she's wearing also like a loose sleeve. Um, like kind of like a jacket kimono. And it's really nice. It matches with her bobby bag. Oh, I love the bobby bag. And it's just a really nice, cute uh, outfit. Uh, I'm just going to scroll down looking at the other outfits that I want to talk about. Um... This next outfit here is kind of like, uh, she's wearing the same bra too, but it's like different designs. And it looks like she's wearing pants with also a flowy jacket. It's really nice. This collection is really like comfortable and it's like a really nice design as well. I don't know the name of the, of the design yet, but it is kind of like tropical, tribal-like to me. The jacket, you can definitely see there's palm trees. Um... Oh, and this next outfit here, she's holding a book tote, and also she is wearing the same bra, and also the underwear. It could be actually shorts, but it looks kind of tight, so it could be underwear. I'm not too sure what it is yet, but it is very nice. I love the bra. Could probably wear like a blazer outside, it would look amazing. But I am very interested in the book tote that she's holding. It's like a tan, like gold book tote. Um, it's really nice. There, I will show a picture right here, but... It's a very nice book tote. Um, I'm, I'm kind of eyeing it actually. I don't know if I will purchase it, but it is a very nice book tote. I only have two book totes right now. And this book tote, the design on the side already looks amazing. So I don't know. I might like it. And it does match the like lingerie outfit. It's very nice. And then we have another lingerie design. I really like the pants. Actually, I'm not too sure if it's underwear. It's probably pants. Um, because usually Dior lingerie on the top of the pants or the shorts would be Christian Dior, but this one is black line. So I think this is actually shorts, and these are a really nice design, so I would probably get them. I would definitely try them on in the boutique when it comes out. I think this collection might drop in December or January. This next outfit, we have a tulle skirt with this gorgeous, gorgeous sweater. I would definitely have to try it on in the boutique. It's such a gorgeous floral print. We have like a black dress on top, or sorry, a black skirt. And then when you go on to the bottom, it has like flowers growing up. It's so nice. I love this outfit a lot. This next one is a brown dress. It is very nice. I love the headband that she's wearing because it matches with her dress. Dior, I'm not too sure if it's like a headband or if it's a scarf that they use to tie it, but it's very nice. And of course, the classic, they always wear a long fashion jewelry necklace. And then I just love the dress. It's really nice. It is um, translucent kind of. So you would have to wear maybe a like a tank top dress inside. Or maybe if you want to be sexy, you can just wear a bra and then some type of like, um, like spandex. That would look nice as well. Next one is actually pretty nice. I think it's a dress. A dress? Pants? Dress? Not too sure, but I do like the belt that she's wearing. It's very unique. I think it is one belt, and just, they probably wrap it around the dress a few times. And I, I am very curious about the bobby she is holding. It is camel, but I see there's some kind of design on it. So I am very interested in that. Can't wait to see it in the boutique. Now we're moving on to more like black outfits before it's kind of like brown and gold. Now we have black, and I love this black dress that this model is wearing. Also the same like floral print coming up from the bottom. She's wearing a Dior bra and then Dior underwear of course. Looks so nice. This next one is, it kind of gives me beach vibes. Um, it is a lace dress. It is super, super sexy. Personally, not my style, but I think it looks really nice. It's very sexy. It definitely is really good, like a beach outfit for me. I think it's very nice. Um, very sexy on the top, but the bottom is really nice. A full lace dress. It is see-through, so... Um, I think this will be good for the beach if you want to wear that. Um, under will be your bikini. Or you can wear like a bra and then of course do or lingerie like underwear or shorts. Um, like I said, the handbag is really unique. I have not seen it yet with those fringes and, and I have no idea what kind of bag it is. But it's very um, cool looking so I am excited to see that. But overall my opinion of the spring summer 2021 collection... Um, I am interested in seeing those like unique like bucket bags, the book totes, and then also like the floral print, the sweater, and also the skirt, and also the scarf or like just a regular headband. 
definitely interested in that. I don't know if this collection will have a lot of like bucket hats or berets because usually um, in the runway show they don't really show a lot of the hats but I am hoping because I do love doer hats. So yeah, overall this collection is really nice. Um, I wouldn't say it's my favorite. My favorite would be Dior Cruise 2020, uh, Dior Cruise 2019 because of the Trois de Gris animal print. But I always say that every time there's like a runway show. I don't like it at first, but later when we see like the whole collection, all the handbags, then I'll pick up, pick out all my favorites, and I will say this collection is amazing. So I wouldn't say I hate it. I wouldn't say I love it. Um, but yeah, it's still an amazing collection. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Please subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Instagram at Tristrin. Use my hashtag CDRHolics. Uh, suggest any videos down below. Take a look at my TikTok account and I will see you guys next time. Bye!